Hi, right, this is Jack with Knights Armored Company at 2014 Shop. Here to talk through some of our new product line. First off, we've got the SR15 E2 Mod 2. Some really neat improvements with this gun. Uh, we're going to a QDC flash hider. It's compatible with all of our QDC line of suppressors, the long and short can. Change the gas system now, working on a castle nut, retaining the gas block, it self-indexes on the barrel. Going to a straight gas tube with an AN fitting, which allows us to uh, seal the system off for better gas reliability. Going to a URX4 handguard, this is sporting a 14 and a half inch length to fully protect the barrel, give you a lot of options for hand placement as well as accessory mounting. This has an integral barrel nut, which allows us to essentially form a monolithic upper receiver, high, uh, moderate amount of torque to hold this uh, together. Going back into the system that everybody already knows and loves, full ambidextrous controls, we've got an extended charging handle latch, as well as now we've got a ambidextrous latch that can be put on separately. Of course, we've got ambidextrous lower controls and that ambidextrous bolt release. We've got a uh, full line of key mod accessories that are available on the website www.knightarmco.com. You can also find all of our uh, Knights Army gear there. It's a full suppressor line, for a full line of uh, all of our rail mounting accessories and key mod accessories. Moving on to the SR25 E2 APC Advanced Precision Carbine. We've done the same thing with the gas system, moving over to this system that we saw in the SR-15, going to a straight gas tube as well, going into that AN fitting retained by a castle nut. We've got our QDC flash hider that's compatible with our full line of QDC suppressors. You can see here our outstanding uh, Knight's Armament mount, renowned for, renowned for its robustness in the field, zero retention, and reliability once it's placed back on to retain that zero when properly torqued. Change the bolt on this to a dual ejector bolt. It simplifies a little bit of maintenance, uh, also improves the ejection force, as well as the system reliability. Classable stock, 10 position classable stock here, as well as ambidextrous controls, improved bolt re uh, release and bolt catch, ambi mag catch, mag release, as well as our uh, ambidextrous bolt release. Now we talked a little bit about the key mod accessories. You can see here we've got our full handguard system. And moving on, you can see some more of the accessories. Got a surefire scout mount, can be placed on any position on that rail, fore or aft, wherever that user likes it. Keeps it very tight to the rail uh, for that uh, easy access with a finger. Got a new uh, skeletonized barrier stop, gets really good purchase from any angle that comes on. Sheds weight, made of steel for absolute uh, reliability and robustness, as well as it can be a direct mount sling hook. Got our hand stop, anywhere on the rail you want it to go, forward or reversed. Once again, that full line of our key mod grill panels. And uh, that pretty much wraps up the SR25. Of course, once again, if you want to see any of these accessories, you can go to our website. Our website is live, especially by the time you see this, it'll be up and running. So thanks for joining us at Spec Monkey uh, here at the 2014 shot.